that's, that's probably how they wanted it. Yeah. All right, let's uh, keep going here and speak to uh, Kenneth, who's 28. Kenneth? Yeah. What's up? Hey, how you doing, Adam? Good. Uh, I got a, quite a few questions, actually. All right. Um, we'll dig this. Uh, here's the thing. I, uh, I, I, I was orphaned, and uh, then I was adopted by my aunt. Uh, how do you get um, orphaned? How do you get orphaned officially? Uh, just like dropped off, you know. Um, mm. Where'd you get dropped? About, well, my mom was about 15, 16 years old. You know, it was, you know, mid 70s. She likes to party, you know. So, uh, sure. She drops. She drops me off at my aunt's house. Right. You know, uh, technically, and uh, she leaves me there for about a year and a half. You know, and then I uh, wants to come back and get me. And uh, my aunt says, "Well, look, I'm kind of attached, you know." Uh, I, I don't really want to, so they go through this big court thing. Now, here's the weird part: is that there was rumor that my aunt actually, and I know this might sound far-fetched, right? But my aunt actually paid the judge about thirty grand and put me in a body cast uh, so that it would appear that you know uh, she was able to take care of me, so to speak, because she was going against a you know sixteen-year-old. Uh, you know, burnout hippie chick, you know. Okay, and, uh, so well, let's just make sure we're on the same page. Mom right, drops you off at the aunt's house right when on. she's like uh, 15, 16. Right. Your aunt keeps hold of you. Hold on. Aunt. Excuse me, Charles. <laughs> How old the <laughs> aunt keeps hold of you. <laughs> no, excuse me, auntie. Say aunt. How old was your oh, auntie? Sorry, the is, the is auntie, auntie keep, aunt. keeps hold of you. How old the was white she? guys say aunt. The black right. guys and the English guys say aunt. <laughs> right. How old was she? The okay, aunt. so your aunt <laughs> is how old? Yes. My aunt was uh, 30. 30. So yeah. she's 15 years older than your mom. Right. This is your mom's older sister. Mm-hmm. Huh. And she raises you for a year and a half. Right. Then your mom wants you back. Well, you know, she just comes back and says, hey, he's mine. Uh, I came to get him, you know. Let's just say yes. She wants <laughs> yes. you back. Okay. Yes. Your, yes. your aunt does not want to give you back. Yes. <clears throat> so now there's a court battle. Yes. And your aunt puts you in a body cast? So I'm told. Well, so you don't you remember. Know, I mean, I, I was, no, no, here, so here listen, listen, I was in a body cast, but I was told that it was because I had a uh, dislocated hip when I was born. The doctor smacked me, dislocated my hip. This is what I was told as a child. That's an angry doctor. <laughs> yeah, there, there's no such thing as that. You can dislocate your hips because right. they weren't properly checked, and people, babies can have Wait. lax hip that can dislocate and cause arthritis. But you don't go in a body cast for that. No, right. But and I would ask my 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 aunt, my my adopted mother. I would say, you know, why don't I have a scar? She said, oh, well, they did it with uh, with a uh, Raj, you know. And and but you gotta understand, I'm a kid, so of course I'm gonna. You know, believe what she's telling right, me. But what, what, how did your aunt uh, get a doctor to put you in a cast? I, I mean, I don't know, but I have pictures of me being in a cast with a bar between my legs, and I'm in a cast from like. Oh, okay. Other All right. Okay. Cast. Got right. it. I got it. Right. Okay. So maybe right. that was a legitimate yeah. thing, whatever yeah. it was. Yeah. Okay. okay. All right. So now she says she has to take care of you. So the okay, but yeah, okay. All right. Just yeah, listen. I mean, it gets a lot. It gets a lot uh, more interesting. Well, so what's the court do? Uh, well, the court uh, gives my uh, my adopted mother custody, and I and I live with her. Okay. The adopted uh, mother's your aunt. The auntie, auntie right? Right, right, right. right. Well, let's just call, call her that, please. Don't start swapping oh. titles. It gets confusing. Okay, okay, okay. So call her my aunt. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Okay, okay, okay. So um, I got uh, my aunt got custody of me. My my uh, my biological mother. She you know uh, skipped town or what have you. Uh, went ahead with her life. Right. All right, can I skip ahead here? Say yeah. sure. Yeah, please. go ahead. Please do. Actually, bring it all the way through to the time I'm home, <laughs> beating off and drinking red wine. That's it's about an hour and twenty-five from now. Okay, please. no, listen. Okay, I skip ahead. All right, eighteen years. Today, Junior. Mm-hmm. No, I'm getting to it. Listen, uh, skip ahead eighteen years. Uh, we're in her apartment. Uh, she's tipsy. I'm tipsy, and she sits on my lap. And who? Your auntie? She, Mom. Oh, no, well. no, my biological mother. She all pulls right. her skirt up, mm-hmm. all right, mm-hmm. and places my hand on her ass. Mm-hmm. Now, I, 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 I do. I, I, I uh, I'm th- at this point. I'm thinking like just, just a, a male, right? You're how old? Oh hell no! I'm 18. That sure, point. sure. We've all, we've all had a go at her mom. <laughs> now listen, listen. Yeah. Uh, now 
because I didn't spend a lot of time with her, it seemed like she was more like a friend of the family. Yeah, I mean, yeah. that's cool. I yeah. uh, I promptly picked her up and uh, took her into the bedroom. And Rick shot. And she told me, we should not do this. I'm your mother. Oh. And I said, you know, look, come on, baby. You know, we're... Sure. You know, I mean, it... You got your game face on. Right, yeah. Right, I, right. I, listen, look, I understand. It, it's the bottom of the ninth, and I got to hit a home run. All right. No, the, the, but the train was leaving the station. I, I got that. I understand. I've been there Saturday night. <laughs> no, no, I you don't understand. You got a couple of wine coolers in your mom's looking pretty good. <laughs> <laughs> no, but we've listen, all been listen. there. We've all been. No, there. No, listen, this isn't. No, no, this. But but it's like the from the family. It's not like. Uh, I mean, it's. All right. Yeah. So, all right here we go. All you right. had no relationship with mom. Right. We get that. So, even so though they have sex. Been. You have sex with mom. Okay. Uh, this is and by the way, I don't blame Kenneth. Right. Hang on, right. hang on. It, 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 it has to have some kind of effect on you with some sort of primitive biological yeah. level. A, B, the, the really messed up person in this whole equation is the mom. Right. Yeah, because she was so. an adult when she gave, hang on, hang on, okay. I hear this okay. more. She was the adult when she gave birth to you. She saw you grow up. She knew you as a child, and here she is doing this crap right. to you as an adult. Right. And, she, and she had a relationship of sorts with you from an adult posh position. Here's, here's the twist. He gets her pregnant and gives birth to himself. Oh. Yes. Oh. Yes. That's All right. The so then, what happened? Wait, wait. There's okay. More. Well, listen. She she uh, she uh, came down with uh, 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 cirrhosis of the liver. Great. Right. She Fantastic. became a crack and heroin addict. Yeah, I was right. gonna say. Well, the shorty and, uh, was the shorty was a heroin addict. That's how she got the cirrhosis. And she, and, and chronic hepatitis. Okay. C. And did she pass along? Yes, she did. Okay. Now you got to get checked for hepatitis. Do you think how long ago? That? You think about how that part? No. How long ago checked. was this? Ninety-three. And you've been. Oh. You got to get checked for hepatitis. Yeah. Let's, let's tell the tell the doctor you were uh, sharing a joint or something. You know, don't, <laughs> yeah, don't tell him. Don't that. Get you your mom. You know, all the yeah. details, but yeah. But okay, but listen to this. Then my aunt told me uh, that that uh, that my biological mother's dad had a uh, had a relationship with his mother. Now, when she told me this, I said, Wait, wait, wait. Bi biological mother's dad. Yes. Yeah. So her dad, well, her dad undoubtedly was a piece of work. Right. Jesus Christ. Yeah. yeah. So, okay. uh, All right, so Ken, listen to me. I'm delighted, you know, though. The you know how many medications I'm, uh, uh, I did? All right, but listen, Ken, right. listen. I got, I got, a, I got a, <coughs> just a couple seconds left here, so I'm going to lay out a quick plan for you. All you right. you got to get checked for hepatitis. All right? Yeah. Just tell the doctor you had sex with someone you thought may have hepatitis. B and okay? B and C get checked for. B and C. All right. But doesn't this make me just quiet down? No. It doesn't mean you're just you're just a victim. You just you're a victim. You're victim. You're, victim. Yeah. You're, victim. Yeah. you're, victim. you're victimized. Okay. Se sec 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 quiet I down. Just Listen just to me. Secondly, you need to not have any kids. Can you do that? Yes. Okay. Oh, right on. All right. Third, you got to get some therapy. Treatment. And well, then she's you, always on meds. So. Okay, fourth, stop beating yourself up. You got a horrible, abused life, and you get on with it. L got read, it read on stuff, with yeah. my mom. All read right. stuff out there about trauma survivorship because you, you are a trauma survivor all through and through. Yeah. And, I, you know, I think as a guy, like as, as, a, as a woman, and we talk to these women all the time, when their dad has sex with the daughter, this is, uh, they're victims, clearly. I mean, yeah. this happens all the time in society. You know, our hearts go out to these poor women who are vi clearly victims. But when the son does it to the mom, we don't look at the son. First off, we don't hear it that much. And then secondly, we don't look at him as the victim because he's, he's the male. male. Yeah. And he's on top of the woman, you yeah. know. But he is just as much a victim well, yeah, as yeah. they were. Here's what you have to think of. It wasn't, it's victimization implies some sort of a passive paralysis and being, you know, what he was was exploited. Yeah. Right. And exploitation yeah. is a form of victimization. So. Exactly. All right. So, Kenneth, do not beat yourself up. No, not don't, at all. Man. Don't beat me up. Don't beat anybody up. Just mm -hmm. go to the doctor one step at a time. Annie? Yeah. You're 19.